That should be good. Oh, that's gonna be so loud at the beginning of the stream. Milo, where you going? Milo, babies, where you going? You okay, Milo? Are you just stretching? Let's see, view on YouTube. Oh, do you want under the blankie? Here you go, Milo. Money videos. What happened? Am I still streaming? It says I'm still streaming. What the hell was that? Wait, everything went black on my screen for a second. And save. There we are. Now, 
We gotta go get the link. Heading over to Redito. I've got the freaking um What's it called? I've got like the Toka Toka Loka Loka song stuck in my head, but just like the the part that has like the the part that people have been doing like the dance meme with. Right, yeah, I gotta put the streaming. God, my bottom lip has been cracking like crazy. It's getting annoying.
almost done. Alright, I do believe I am ready to go now. Y'all ready for some bug fables? I am. We're invading the... oh I need my wawa. I need my wawa. No, my mic. Stinky. Well, the termite capital. I, uh... I need to update the name. <laughs> um... Destinations. View on YouTube. Oh. I'm big stupid. I am made of stupid. I never knew I could be made out of so much stupid. Termite tournament. Save. View on Twitch. Why? Um... Where is stream editor? Here we are. Safe. There we are. 
Jed Leo! How are you doing? I, uh, I needed to update the titles for my streams because um, I, I completely forgot we had done the wasps already. Sorry if I don't chat much and it's acting up. Uh, I hate when that happens. That's alright though. You are my friend, and I'm glad to have you around in any form. In any form. Am I good? I'm. Yeah, I have to find the tournament, right? Kingdom inside structure. <laughs> well, duh. My kingdom's full of paint and happy stuff. The city's all dull. Some bugs are born in such a place, and don't get to see the lush Bulgarian outskirts. Most termites don't like sunlight. We hear. So they probably don't mind this. Some bugs are really weird. It's that culture thing, I guess. Yeah, I think I have to fight in the tournament. Colosseum awaits. Um, where's my inventory? Inventory. That's pretty good. stuff. Nice. Hello. Hmm, you're the Ant Kingdom Knights? A bit scrawny, out of shape. <laughs> Excuse me. That's whatever. Everyone's looking forward to a new challenger. You ready to go? You'll do three straight fights when you're in. It's beatdown time! Alright, please cross to the left door. I placed a bet on you for kicks and giggles, so good luck. <laughs> if I give you some berries, can you buy higher and pay me later? No. Aww. <laughs> uh, I think that'd be something that I would try to do as well. There's a big queen. That's a THICK queen. Yas queen slay. <laughs> My dear workers, scientists, termites of every kind, today is a battle unlike those you're used to seeing. The honor of our kingdom is on the line. These foreign knights claim they can best our best of the very best. How much better way to test that claim than with the ancient tradition of our ancestors. The good old public fisticuff. How many rounds will they get through, I wonder? Without further ado, let's begin. From the left gate, V the bee, Kabu the beetle, and Leaf the moth. Team Snake Moth. Hey, don't forget Lily. We should have picked another name. Didn't expect us to get famous. Fits us perfectly. Focus on the battle. We'll do awesome like always. Now from the right gate, let's warm up our visitors, shall we? They shall face fierce beasts from the forbidden lands. Now, battle. I'm gonna slay. Let's see what we got. Yes. This is the setup I want. Yeah. Damn, really?
It's hideous and it's got some defense. We can barely hurt it if we want to give it a roll. Shit. Okay. Um, in that case, I'll ignore you and go for the mimic spider. Jesus Christ. Heavy strike. I'm gonna want to switch up. There we are. Nice. All right, what's next? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? BRB gonna raid my ISP. Child's play. Woo! V! Cabo Leaf! Yeah, let's go! Child's play indeed, it's time for our second act. We will now face Cross and Poir, the bravest of our border gods. Oh, I'ma beat the ass. Well, it's nice to see you again. We won't go easy on you. Give it your all. It was your trust that got us this far. Wait, was that copy saying that? It was your trust that got us this far. We'll honor you with a good fight. Yeah, yeah, let's go. Uh, spike arts. I'm sorry, Cross. We never m meant to drag you into this. Everyone, watch out for his crossbow. We must give him. We must give them a worthy battle. Our apologies, Pa. We know you're just doing your job. Everyone, watch out for his sword and cannon. He must fight with honor. Both their defenses are zero, so I'ma just uh, go through y'all one at a time. Oh shit, you can use items. No matter. Go Chompy! Lily! Oh, you killed yourself. <laughs> Incredible. 
Please, forgive us for having to beat you up. Eh, it's all in good sport. So you have, hmm, so you have some skill. Oh my, dear Poir and Cross are not easily beat. Whatever, you're claiming victory so easily. Now you will have, now you will face, uh, fuck. You will face a captured creature that insults fear and the most hardened veteran. Oh, you, are you sure? Unleash the primal weevil. We've beat this thing before. Oh, he doesn't know, huh? You gotta beat it again? What a dull show, don't you all think? My dear public deserves better, so much better. Who is it? Not again! You're one and only, you're one, you're only, the most loved in the termite kingdom. No. Oh, it's Mothava. Oh, ho, ho. her voice is smooth as ever. Sup? <laughs> what are you doing here? No way we'd let you steal any queen's graces. When I heard you were coming, I just had to crash this party. What do you gain from making this harder for us? Yeah, we're on the same team. Show us to prove the enemy's strength, but also your strength, Team Snake Myth. If we defeat you, we'll show we're superior to you. And then the Queen's gonna have to tag us along. This is ridiculous. You realize you could be dooming us all. What if the Termite Kingdom loses trust in the Queen? What if you lose to the Wasp King without our help? Have you gone completely, utterly insane? Have you lost all intelligence? Yikes. You're overthinking this way too much. The Young Kingdom's way better in our hands than with you losers. We have saved your life before, you witch! I said we'd never speak of that again. Zasp, you've helped us many times. Can't you talk some sense into her? Don't misunderstand. I'm not doing this only for Mothava. Although it's a pretty big reason. Uh, I want the Primal Weevil back. Just shut up and fight, you cowards! Let's get the crowd wild and cheering. I changed Mothra's words. Team Snake Moose. <laughs> I agree. Anything to see Mothra perform. How serendipitous. I'm looking forward to this. The fight starts now. Fight! Okay. Uh, put you up front. And the plan is to freeze Zasp. No? Okay. Let's do that again. Damn, really? Well, I can't do it again. So... Bruh, freeze, come on. Shit. Okay. God dang, they kicking my ass.
I'm gonna want to heal. Can't perform secret stash. I just hope that whatever attack she does just cannot kill me in one hit. Seriously, Zasp? Get up! No. Okay. It will be better to just die. Shit. Okay, so... Just gonna keep on coming back up. Fucker. Stop it. Probably gonna want to do ice rain. Actually, I'll try and do frigid coffin again. Finally, God. Actually, you know what?
Yeah! Dead. You don't mess with Team Snake Mouth. Snake Mouth. <sighs> Martha. Oh, is this enough for you? Come on, just drop it. I'm not even tired yet. You better give up. <sighs> Fine. Fine, whatever. I give up. You win. You happy now? I can see it takes a bit that Today you're better than us. <laughs> what a pathetic end. You got beat by the main character. That's not pathetic at all. What what an incredible battle. Bagaria holds so much strength. I mean <laughs> This is what I call records of Bagaria. <laughs> Shumatsu no Ant Kingdom. <laughs> oh my dear. Thank you everyone. We're all the best, aren't we? Make sure to come to my next show. You'll get even closer to me. Jesus. Whoops. Guess there's a new hot band in town. <laughs> Can't believe they're cheering for you. Justice is quite popular with the crowd. Maybe termites just have awful taste. Yeah. Malva, you'll always have your true fans. Like me. Like me. <laughs> Come on, everybody. Say my name one more time. V. Kabuleef. Malva. Say my name. Oh crap. I accidentally hit a button. This concludes today's battle. Team Snakemoth, please meet us back at the Royal Chamber. Theatrics aside, there are serious things to discuss. You fought well, and we shall see you there. That's a thick ass queen. <laughs> Stupid crowd. <laughs> well, go on ahead. No weird tricks. Just shut up. I don't want to hear you ever again. Ugh. Bye. Poor you. I feel so tired. But we did it. <laughs> no time for the end. Let's get going to the palace. I need to stock back up because they fucking wasted my shits. Um, ooh. Reverse toxin. Mmm. That's not all that good. I can buy four items. Hardest mode playthrough. Looks like I missed some streams. Eh. Uh, I'm not entirely sure how many streams you missed. It's what else. I'll buy the honey drop. Berry. And magic seed. Yeah, so I I cannot imagine doing a hardest mode playthrough of this. I would immediately give up. <laughs> like I know you're supposed to get cool like um I know you're supposed to get cool badges and stuff, but like hell no. Twelve, thirteen, twelve. Okay, they restored my TP. Wee. Shit. Team Snake Moose, I've heard of your exploits. You bring honor to our kingdom. Oh yes. That's what we're here for. Um, 
Oh, sweetie, you've got to get over it. Grumble. I'll start then. We acknowledge your plight. The Tynamite Kingdom stands much to lose over this issue. Metals from Ardis is a hard mode thing, but Ardis keeps all the stuff from hard mode and adds even more stats to enemies. Fuck that. <laughs> I have trouble enough with normal mode games. Our finest engineers have been working on a prototype vehicle. It's able to operate and travel under the water. It should be just what you need. We call it the Subaquatic Maritime Neotransport. We're very proud of it. I'd like to call it a submarine for short. Subaquatic Maritime Neotransport. Lyra, are you trying to undermine me? Lyra, you are undermining me. How the f- I fucked that quick- my god. Thank you both from the bottom of my heart. Our people will be able to fight back now. So... It goes under the water? What if it breaks? It's impossible for it to sink. It is our most advanced machine. So, do you know what makes a submarine a submarine? Because I... I always... Because, like, it's called submarine. So you'd expect that it's called a submarine because it goes below the water. But, no. What makes a submarine a submarine is its ability to come back out of the water. And that kind of made me think, oh yeah, if you put a hole in a ship, it'll go underwater. <laughs> so, yeah, submarines are fucking, yeah. What if it does? It shall not, on my name. Please, don't think of su don't think with such cynicism. Alright then, very reassuring. It's stationed at the pier on the rightmost part of the city. Our head of research should be there to explain how it functions. Excellent. We shall draw to the outskirts pier to make sure everything is in order. And, Queen Eliza and, yes? If you'll have them, please let some of our people travel with you. They are eager to see your land. You will cease the separation? Only for now. This can't handle ours. A small step. We'll purchase a bit of land, see how things go. Queen Lyra, King Hector the Fourth. Finally. I am very grateful for everything. We are in your eternal debt. You better repair it when the time comes, or else. She will. She will. A queen is honest and honorable. Thank you. It's fine. <laughs> I'd... I wish, like, it had a name in the text box, or like a picture of the face of whoever's speaking in the text box. Because I cannot tell with this fucking speech bubble tale. Please go, and make haste, and protect Bulgaria. Don't make me regret any of this. We're counting on you, after all. I shall go ahead, I shall go ahead and check on the submarine. Please, meet me at the pier whenever you are ready. Let's go, Lily! Whoa! 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 Um... Actually, I'm gonna check in here again. Oh wait, this is just the burger joint. I don't want no burger. No humbug. This is a convenience store. Is there... What's the thing that I usually look for? Oh shit. This is where the stuff is. Okay. Just stop by my clinic and defiant route. That's the fishing my greatest creation. I need a rare item, the blackest of paints. Bee Kingdom. My dumb brother left without taking his lunch before leaving for the Forsaken Lands. Talk to me outside the Coliseum. All right, so I'm already here. I could talk to that guy first. Never had the opportunity to leave the dome, but I have learned of these weird beings called seedlings. As a researcher, I must know what they are. 
Please come to me in the Termite City. My lab is at the rightmost apartment, fifth floor. Alright. My best friend Nero's gone missing. Knowing him, he ran off to the Forsaken Lands. I need someone to bring me to him. Must be terrified. Meet me outside the Dome Hotel. Got it. I've been working too much, but I cannot stop. I haven't been able to sleep properly for days. Talk to me in Termite City Plaza. Alright. I got tired of these striders taking lives and limbs from poor bugs that go out for a swim. Beat ten of the darn things and come to my house in Ant City for your reward. Alrighty. So. I'll talk to you first. You took my request, didn't you? Indeed. What well, seems to be troubling you? I haven't been able to sleep well for a while. It's starting to affect my work performance. I can't stop. I must work, or else... Jeez, you gotta learn to take it slow, dude. I can't. I must. Look, maybe we can deal with your sleep issues first. Any clues what it can be? Yes. I've heard that if you mix something that can cause sleep with flour, you can make a special recipe that allows anyone to sleep well. I love sweets. Maybe you can get one of those for me. It is worth a try. We'll come back if we find anything. So, anything that's anything that puts someone to sleep with... I'd have to go to Defiant Root for that. So next, talk to you. Hiya, you're Lina, right? Huh? Who are you? We're Team Snake Myth. You've come to aid in your request. Really? I didn't expect anyone to take notice of it so quickly. Thank you. You lost your pet, right? It's close to home. We'll get it back to you. Nero doesn't trust others. If you find them, he'll flee quite quickly. So I'll go with you. Without making sure he's safe, I can't go home on good conscience. Are you sure of this? The Forsaken Lands are quite dangerous. It's the only way. I know I'm asking a lot, but... It'll be fine. Nothing we can't handle. Thank you, once again. Is there any place Nero likes to run off to? Well, south of the pumpkin patch, there's a place Nero really likes. Do you know where that is? Yeah, we went across it while coming here. Shall we depart? Hmm? Let's go. Alright, so there's you... Uh, what else do I have? Specialty, it's too hot. Find the ingredients. What ingredients did you need again? Nectar from the critters of the land, fruit that blooms where there's no life, the essence of frost itself. Meet you in Defiant Root. Well, it's Swamplands Entrance. Metal Island. Elon's looking for something, but his vague request only mentions a golden paradise. Defiant Root. Bee Kingdom. Outside the Coliseum. He's probably inside this way, isn't he? Yep. Ah, oh, yeah, the Iron Kingdom explorers that beat the Coliseum. <laughs> yes. We saw your request. Your brother left without lunch. Hmm. He's always rushing. And then faints from exhaustion in the wilderness. I can't deliver today. It's too busy. I'll pay a pretty berry if you take this to him. Uh, alrighty. Where's his post? Hmm. Today he was supposed to patrol around the broken bridges in the Forsaken Lands. Just walk west from where the weevils hang around. He should have made it before fainting. He's strong, but... Please hurry. We got a wrap lunch. This smells pretty good. He's annoying, but I do love him. It's my super nutritious survival box. Leave it to us. Alright. Next. Metal Island, Paradise, Defiant Root, Bee Kingdom, Lunch. Here we are. Come to me in the Termite City, Lab is at the rightmost. Uh, 
Okay. Fifth floor. Hello, you're the champions from the Yankee Kingdom, aren't you? And you're the seedling guy, right? You're in super luck. We've been fighting seedlings for ages. Hmm? Seedlings have so many variations. Too many for me to research on my busy schedule. So I want you to gather some data on their behaviors for me. Don't worry, though. It's easy. Just defeat them in battle and your experiences should write themselves. I'd like to have data of 50 seedling individuals. Any species of them will do. Once you have that, talk to me and I'll give you your reward. Sounds simple enough. Let's go travel them. Fifty. So much violence! Take this as a token of my appreciation. I made it during my spare time. Sure, it'll be very helpful. Seedling Affinity Medal. The golden token shows your affinity of seedlings. Increases the chance of fighting special things. <laughs> I knew those seedlings would be good for something someday. Once again, thank you. Alright. So now I gotta go to the Forsaken Lands. And this is the pier this way, right? Yeah, I don't want to do the pier just yet. My god, that wind is fucking blowing outside. Oh uh, no, I haven't done it yet. Alright. So... Hey, wait, what's this way? Oh! And away to the Termite Kingdom. Nice. Whew. All right. Ashes. Oh. I don't remember this part. Oh. So hungry. Want your lunch? Is that? Much, much, much. Oh, thank you. That saved me. My brother sent you here, huh? Make it back to work. I get so pumped out I forget to eat. Take this as thanks for saving me. Yo, sweet. Time to finish my patrol and head back home. See you later. Nice nice. Very nice. She's a chan. Thank <laughs> you. 
I don't know where I'm going. I... I meant to hit circle. Oh, not down here. with pumpkins in the Forsaken Lands. Seems to be south from a place. So what if I could just go down then? That's what happens. Okay, it looks like we're kicking some ass. Zero! Bro, just die. How the hell? Fucking hell. See, here's the I wouldn't have such a problem with it if, like, the fucking rocks didn't respawn every time. Fuck. Not a fan, not a fan, not a fan, not a fan. Here. We should reach the area if we head south from here. I hope Neo is alright. Goodness! It's impossible to make out a path. 
Yeah, this area is super foggy. You know, it's got weird taste. Don't worry, everyone. Do you see those shrooms? They're, sh they're shrooms, all right. Magic? I'm a firefly, silly. I glow. Seems it wasn't a waste to bring you with us. Bring me to the shrooms and they'll light up the way with hints. Hang in there, Nero. We're coming. Okay, so... Wait, what? Wait, what the fuck? Alright. So I guess that just means go left. I guess this means go down. Go left. Go up. What? Got a kabu left. Down. Left. Up. Left. Oh, he's cute! Nero! It's so cute. Team Snake Myth, thank you so much. Nero's my best friend. Hm? What's that? Seems to be holding some sort of glow shroom. Although not like the ones that guided us. Well, Nero, you want it off for this? Is that like, a super rare shroom? Not really, but I need it for my family's coming of age tradition. Ibanima! So helpful. It truly is the perfect pet. More than a pet, he's a real friend! <laughs> I can continue my journey now, although I wouldn't mind staying in the Termite Kingdom a little longer. Really? I can't wait to be out of there. There's still a few more things for me to do and see. The web yet. I need to do and see before I go back home. I want to let everyone know how wonderful this place is. Right, Nero? You are! You're right. Just saying thanks is enough, so would you take this? Law book. Found it while looking around and its contents are most incredible. A book? Look, we of course it's enough. We wish you luck on your journey. <laughs> Nero's adorable, I love him. Would you be fine going back? So don't let us hold you back any longer. Make sure to say hi when if you're back in the city. Goodbye, Nero. <laughs> I love how Leaf has a soft spot for cute things. Stop doing that, Kabu! Books aren't worth anything! Books are priceless, V. I'll have you know that. Agreed. You could use a little bit of more culture. <laughs> that reminds me of the, um... Hold on, let me see if I can find it. The great culture of the world. YouTube. Ow. <laughs> that was loud. Here we are. Okay. Um. Oh, that is large. Holy crap.
transform fit to screen here we are okay Looks like an orange fruit by the foot. <laughs> I, lo I love the idea of like some villain in a story whose their only motivation is that they just like books. So, uh,. when uh <laughs> they're just orange and they just like books and the reason they're orange is because they read too many books <laughs> it's just so funny it's very like uh it's a very like tim curry-esque impression jade wolf how are you doing It's meh. Oh no! Did something happen? Lonely. Oh no! Oh my back! Oh! Oh god, that hurts! Oh well, then, hang out with me. Hang out here with us. Let's get going. There's more to do. Have you been able to like VR chat with anybody lately? Someone drew Yo, someone drew you a PFP? Is it the one that you have right now? If it's the one you have right now, it's really cute. Even if it's not the one you have right now, it's still really cute. It's adorable. I love the little bunny. Does that does your shirt say strawberry? I don't recognize this place at all. Who the made sense stands here? Um. I guess I'll leave a burly berry. Oh shit! Thank you! Holy fuck! Straw bunny! That's so cute! Ah oh, shit, how am I supposed to get up? No, no, leave me alone, leave me alone. Fuck! out of here. <laughs> uh, get me out of here. No! Nope, fuck off, snail. Fuck off, mimic spider. No, I'm back here. I just fucking got out of here. I... Shit.
I've been online in VR chat every day at least six hours. Jeez, that's a lot of time in VR chat. Shit, shit. No, 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 no. This is so stressful. That game looks weird. The game I'm playing? Play Rain World instead of VR Chat. What's Rain World? Oh my god, am I out of here? Please god, tell me I'm out of here. Oh, thank fuck. Okay, let's see. You need a golden seedling. You need an umbrella. I have no idea where an umbrella is, though. The essence of frost itself is magic, guys. Other than that, I don't know what the other ones are. Defiant root. Wild Swamplands, Metal Island, Golden Paradise, Defiant Root, Bee Kingdoms, so Defiant Root. I need to go to Defiant Root for Flower, Ant City. Defiant Root it is! Huh. That's weird. Why does the termite kingdom not have, like, a symbol for a termite? It just has a crown. Defiant root. Okay. So I need to talk to... I also need to figure out how to open this goddamn door. Because like, it looks like you can just sneak right in, right under. Oh, 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 oh. A succulent berry. I need to get one of those from the Metal Island. So... Actually, you know what? I gotta go to Metal Island in the first place to get a succulent berry. So I'll go to the Metal Island. Hold on, you're new. No, you're not. You're goth. You get sucking up berries from the Lost Sands or the Caravan there, though, right? I just know that I can get succulent berries here. Ah, oh, but they're pricey! Oh, wait, no. These are tangy berries. Oh, okay. Goth moth, goth moth, goth moth. Succulent berries from Lost Sands of the Caravan. Yep, I'm stupid. Uh, so I would want to go to the Golden Settlement anyways, right? 
Not the Golden Settlement, uh, Defiant Root. The Caravan? Who is the Caravan again? Is that the... Like the, the Red Cricket and the Small Cricket? Like the Sexy Cricket? <laughs> the south of Root. I can break this! Yes! Man, fuck this bullshit. I don't want to do that. Fucking... So much work just to get a fucking bridge to turn. My internet died. Oh no! Is it okay now? Oh wait, oh my god, I'm stupid. South. There's, uh, there's that one area. Whee! Yeah, here we are. <gasps> Succulent Berry! What? I do need to raise my health anyways. And then I can cook together the dark cherries and the magic seed. Okay, you're just a bee guard. <laughs> Magic seed. V bug fables. Hello, Nessie. Your name looks familiar. How are you doing? Oh, wait, no, that's not Nessie. That Ness is PKOK. -okay. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing? V bug fable. I'll help you train him. Second one, Barry. Octopus. Fellow Mother Series fan. Second one, Barry's real fire comes out when you bake it. I cannot talk. Wait, did he just worsen the berry? 
A spicy bomb. With an Obama honey. <laughs> Are you sure? Vicarious, but mostly worried. It's uh, really risky, but the legend says it'll bring honey to a new level. I was really scared to try before, but I've trained so much. I think I can pull it off. Let's believe in Crispy. We don't. Why did we take that mission? I mean, you're right, but. It was forbidden, it's probably super delicious. <laughs> He's a foodie, and he loves the cute things. As long as you have enough berries. Okay, the the. Okay, jeez, we'll bring it. I've got a bad feeling, though. Thank you so much, I won't disappoint you, I promise. Anyways, I need to put together... Uh, yeah, because restores 2 HP to the- oh, to the party! Okay, no, that is better than the, what it was before. Miracle Shake. Oh, I'll give you a Miracle Shake. <laughs> Two ingredients. Burly Berry. Spicy Berry. Okay. And then, anything else I can put together? I got a honey. I got some of that honey money. Let's blow up this popsicle stand. Okay, so... You need something that can put him to sleep, so I'll probably need like a numbnail dart or something, or like a sleep bomb. Hmm. Uh, here he is. Is it going to make a drowsy cake or something? Yeah, drowsy cake. I can just find a drowsy cake. There's a guy that sells them. At the Golden Settlement. Wonder, is there anything here that can make you drowsy? Numbing the eater. Shroom, poison bomb, poison dart. No, thank you. Japan's been a really useful late game, though they've helped me a lot in the hardest playthrough so far. Are you gonna play Sons of the Forest? Um. I'm not entirely sure. Like, it sounds fun. Uh, I haven't played The Forest. I, I've been wanting to, but I haven't really, like, had anyone to play it with. Also, I play at, like, 5 in the morning, and no one is awake at 5 in the morning. <laughs> Eat The Forest. Thanks to Burly Bombs, I was able to shred B33 with Tornado Toss, Poison Attacker Strats. I don't remember how I killed B33. You gotta play the forest first. Like, I know I know what the twist of the forest is. Oh, you know what? Nah. I was gonna say I could buy a danger spud, but I don't have a burly berry. Okay, so... Oh wait, I gotta talk to someone here, right? You. Where's my claw? Whoa, chill out. You're in gear, right? You lost that claw thing? Yes, those darn wasps. I'm sure they're responsible. 
Bug Fables has a banging soundtrack. Change my mind. I won't because your opinion is based. <laughs> uh, hold on, my hair is impaling me. Sounds ass. Hey, you think everything sounds bad. Wouldn't one sooner blame the bandits? As if those uncultured criminals would know the value of my claw. Yeah, everyone likes Sabaton. Ow, god, I just cracked my lip again. Oh, fuck. Mmm. Oh, that's a bad crack, too. Holy fuck. Oh, god. If it wasn't the wasps, they hired the bandits to do it. What's Sabaton? It is... I cannot play it on stream, but, uh... Oh my god. Oh, that is going. Hmm. Uh, they're a power metal band. Oh, my, my lip, it cracked. Like, these are, these, are the, the, these are the worst that my lips have ever been in a while. I wonder, what if I wear my mask? My lips have been cracked for like, I want to say three weeks now. Oh, now that I put the mask on, the face, the face tracker doesn't know what to do. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll keep the mask off for now, but I'm probably going to put it back on. Ah, oh, fuck. It's not much of a clue, is it? Look, it's gotta be in their kingdom, or the far grasslands. If anyone can find it, it's for us, right? We're not. We shall recover your claw! It stares. You know what? Fuck this. I'm just gonna go buy a drowsy cake. Um. So, he want... What does Crispy want again? Shit. I went too far. I went too far. Spicy Bomb and the Obama Honey. Do wa bu wa bu wa You should remove the first K from your name, it would be funny. From my name? Oh, Ness is pokey. <laughs> I've always wanted to play the forest, but broke. Same. Same. It's a good thing I've, uh, I have a large collection of games. I used to have a collection of physical games, but uh, those got stolen, so... Whoa, whoa. Fun, fun, fun on me. Everyone says it like you suggested. I mean, the first time I read it, it was uh, Nessie. <laughs> I read it as Nessie. Uh, Golden Sediment. Yeah, look, drowsy cake. And then to make a spicy bomb, I could just mix this with a spicy berry, right? Cousin of mine stole my Smash Bros. Yo! I'm so sorry, that's awful. My cats steal my lifetime. You have cats? You do have cats! You have Zelda! What other cats do you have? Ooh, don't go punching people now. You want a fucking golden seedling piece. I love this bee, and I ship this bee with Kabu. And Kalamet. Do do do. 
What is that song called again? You don't steal my Smash Bros for the 64 on my watch. 64? Yo, I thought you were talking about like, um... Uh... Ultimate. I thought you were talking about Ultimate. Mario Kart Double Dash. I think the last time I even touched Double Dash, it was like a demo at a Hollywood video. Ultimate? No one can steal it. Well, not with that attitude. <laughs> You're not trying hard enough. <laughs> um... Is it just called Lullaby? It can't just be called Lullaby. Fleeting Lullaby, that's what it's called. I've got Fleeting Lullaby, the uh, One Piece song, stuck in my head. Otto is such a good singer! Like, I have like, five songs from her already in like, my music playlist. My Double Dash broke and I can't afford a new one. No! Pirate. God, oh, that sucks. My... I'm fairly certain all my Nintendo 64 games are probably, like, bad now. They're in storage, but the storage unit got raided once. So a lot of stuff got stepped on and smashed. And there was also a rat infestation one time and a lot of cords got chewed up. Piracy is legal as long as nobody knows. So, um, as I see it, if you buy the game, or if you've had the game before, then you can pirate. Um, because, like, you, you already gave them money, so... <laughs> Like, I, I feel it should be, like, fair at that point. Which reminds me, I need to do, like, a Pokemon Black, Black and White, and Black and White 2 playthrough one of these days. But I did Melee once because I'm not about to spend three... Yeah, like, that type of shit is, like... Here's the, here's the thing, here's the thing, here's the thing, here's the thing. Nintendo is ass... They want you to spend so much money just to play a game that you already own. And they refuse to... Like, they've only been doing good, like, after the Wii. But then they shut down the stores, so you can no longer, like, keep those versions anymore. Like, when they shut down the Virtual Console, like, that was a very bad move. Like, the Virtual Console was, like, one of the best reasons to, like, own a Wii in the first place. Is Return of Dreamland... Return to Dreamland Deluxe? Well, yeah, it has new content. Honestly, like, I love the Kirby games. I love the Kirby games so much. My, my first stream was, it was an eight hour long, uh, Kirby, it was an eight hour long Kirby's Dreamland, I want to say. Was it Kirby's Dreamland? It was the one with Nightmare in it. You don't like Kirby? Wolf. <laughs> Check yourself before I wreck you. How can you not like Kirby? He's cute, he's tiny, he's pink, he's a, he's a little pollo. He's a little pollo. How can you not like the pollo? Wreck me, Mommy Jade. Mmm, you, you, you're getting a little sussy. You're getting a little sussy there, Wolf. Must be sacrificed to the pollo gods. What are you talking about? There's only one Pollo God. His name is Jesus. <laughs> I 
Oh my god, the terminal montage videos are amazing, I love them. Um... What, what the fuck else am I doing here again? Crispy... Uh, Ingaira... Somewhere in the far grasslands... Wild Swamplands... Metal Island... Stop by my clinic in Defiant Roots. Oh, you! Yeah! <laughs> Not even Jesus can save me. Proud atheist. Heal bugs. But what if I don't want to heal the bugs? Dr. Isao, doing well? Why, yes, that permit. You saw my request? Then eat the bugs. Ugh. No, fuck that. Yeah. Uh, we'd like to hear more about your miracle cure. You see, I've been studying Bulgaria's flora and their properties for many months now. I found a combination that should shield any illness. Uh, wow, I fucked up that voice. How would you not want to heal the bugs? Free protein. Ugh. Well, because, see, here's the thing, I'm an adventurer. I don't- I adventure. I don't heal bugs. That's a doctor's job, that's her job. Whoa, that's a berry maker right there. Um, no, my hope is to be able to offer cheap treatment. What?! You are a noble soul. I will gladly lend you my strength. I fucking love Kalu. I love V. I love Leaf. I love this game. We're assuming the missing ingredient's not going to be easy to get. Have you all heard of the Snake Muth Den? Yes. We're very familiar with its depth. <laughs> uh, yeah. Team Snake Muth. Totally not familiar with the Den of Snake Muth. Although the white Sophie petal I seek actually grows over the den itself, I hear. I haven't found a way to reach that high place. So we should try to get really high up. Leave it to us. With V's flight, there's nowhere we can't reach. I'll be counting on you. Don't get hurt. Okay. Tired dad that has to be nice because he gets mad at the kids. The kids tell his wife and he will get no dinner. No, 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 no. Kabu's the cool dad. He, he's, Kabu is the dad that is so chill. You have Leaf, who is the overly hungry kid. The overly hungry son. You've got V, who is the troublemaker daughter. Uh, yeah, you got Lily here. You got Lily here, who is like the favorite. And Kabu is the dad that like lets anything slide. Like Kabu is the dad that tries to like teach you the right ways. Also, Ness, uh, since you are new here, uh, you must be aware of the in-joke that everyone in chat sits on my lap. <laughs> I, uh... Kabu doesn't let stuff slide. Well, nah, but, like... You know, he's chill, he's cool. Cause, like, so, like, I record with my laptop, uh, using the laptop camera. So... I, and I have to keep it on my lap, otherwise, the if I like don't have it on my lap, this looks weird, right? This looks weird. So I have to have it on my lap so that the camera has me like in focus. So the the in joke is that everyone in chat sits on my giant lap. Not that I'm a giant. I just got thick thighs. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a little bunny. Wait, fuck, where am I going? This is not where I want to go. I need to go to the beehive. <laughs> I 
<laughs> I'm stealing your thighs, give them. You're a shorty. <laughs> no, you're just too tall. <laughs> I'm stealing your thighs. No, these are my thighs. You can't have them. You cannot steal my bun 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 buns. Yo, I don't remember you. It's been so boring lately. I wish there was some gossip at least. Or here's some gossip. Beetle flings child. Yuck! <laughs> um, what was I doing again? Why am I here? Artist, that's right. I want thick thighs, but I shall get them my own way. Do okay. Uh, if you want to build up your like your thigh muscle, um, because thigh muscles can actually give you thick thighs. What you're gonna want to do is do squats. Not a lot though. Um, too much squats can actually burn down your muscle. Do I'd say like ten, maybe twenty squats a day. If you're gonna do it every day to 10 squats, if you're gonna do it like, um, every other day, do 20. Uh, and then do, do front lunges, uh, alternate left leg, right leg, left leg, right leg. Uh, do that like five times for each leg. And then do like side lunges left and right, do it five times for each leg, alternating left and right, and then do the front lunges again, and then the side lunges, and then you're gonna want to do stretches, and then just try, like, uh, walking or jogging for, like, uh, 20 minutes to, like, half an hour. You do that every day? I do not do that every day because it is, uh, it's like a foot of snow outside. <laughs> no, I, I tried to do that every day to every other day because I want, I want to lose, I want to lose like some of my fat because I'm, I'm self-conscious about that. <laughs> Give me your snow. I wish I could. The snow outside has made it impossible for me to play outside with my Mylamoo. Isn't that right, Mylamoo? I love you, little babish. I love you, you sleepy little demon. Can you give me some fat while I'm underweight? Take it. Take it all. Except for my boobs, and except for my butt, and except for my thighs. <laughs> Take take my tummy. You'll take my request for you? Yep, don't make a big deal out of it, okay? Alright. I'm looking for the blackest, darkest of paints. I need to complete my masterpiece to challenge Juan's reign as the best artist of the hive. Are you sure you can handle that? Job's a job. Where can I find it? Emo B. Your soul is a dark gray, but anyways, I've heard it's... Wait, are you, are you saying that we can just use V's soul? Hold on, V, I need to dig around inside you for a little bit. Alright, here you go. <laughs> uh, I've heard it's with someone in the termite city. He hates being around in the open, a lover of the darkness. So cool. Oh, I think I know where he might be. I'm only a little underweight, but at least I have good thighs. I, I think I'm overweight. I think clinically I am overweight. Sounds like you two would get along pretty well. Don't speak nonsense. I simply admire him. I would meet him myself were it not so far. Get it done, V. The pay's good. Better be. It really is far away. Now we can just take the fucking, uh... Ant tunnel. You know, I need to tell y'all a funny story. So, when I was younger, 
not not much younger. Um, I want to say I was still in high school around this point. We were cleaning the house, and I. So we we were looking around, cleaning the house, and I saw like a paper with my name on it. I was like, oh, what's this about? I uh, picked up the paper, and it was a medical note from like elementary middle school years. I was like, oh, hey, I haven't seen this before. And so I looked at it, and so growing up, I had always said, oh no, I'm I'm just a I'm just a sad kid. Like there's there's nothing wrong with my head. I'm just really sad for no reason. So I, I look at the paper, and clinically. I was diagnosed with ADD, which I had known before, and I don't think ADD is a recognized condition now anymore. I think it's just uh, under the ter- I think it's just under the umbrella of ADHD nowadays. And depression. <laughs> so I saw that, and I saw it said uh, depression. I was like, oh, well, that explains a lot. <laughs> <laughs> kind of wish I knew this sooner. What's that? Uh, ADD? Or ADHD? Or both? ADD itself is... Well, I have ADHD and depressions. So ADD is Attention Deficit Disorder. It was the... I think it was recognized before ADHD. It was just, like, being unable to, like, pay attention to, like, uh, classes and stuff. Like, fidgeting. But... Then there was ADHD, which my friend was diagnosed with, and I'm fairly certain ADD is not a thing anymore. I think it's just under the umbrella of ADHD, just without the hyperactive symptoms, which would, you know, make it ADD, but it's still just ADHD now. I, th- I think, anyways, I could be totally wrong on that. But, uh, yeah, I've also developed an anxiety disorder over the years, too. ADD is still a thing here. Ah. And why'd you ask me what it was? I don't have mental illness, nothing diagnosed anyway. My sisters have ADHD, OCD, and are on the autism spectrum. Okay, I am fairly certain I'm autistic. Like, fairly certain I'm autistic. I have not, I have not been diagnosed, I, I was a little confused. You're a little confused, but I thought you are verbal wolf. I'm sorry. <laughs> I saw the opportunity for a dad joke and I took it. Um, because it has a different name here. Right, yeah, different languages. I forgot about that. Like, so I'm I'm fairly certain that I have it that I have autism like some form of it could be like Asperger's or just wherever the hell on the spectrum. ADS and ADHS here ah ads and at his <laughs> uh what was I talking about again? Right, so I'm fairly certain that I have like some form of autism. I. Whenever, like, my autistic friends send me, like, autism memes, they get more and more and more relatable the more memes they send. <laughs> Took them 17 years for mine, but I don't like calling myself autistic because I'm kind of extremely high-functioning in the spectrum. So... He- here's the thing. I fluctuate... I could just be, like, completely, like, um, what's the word? It's neuro-something? Like, the opposite of neurodivergent? It's not neurosystemic. <laughs> uh, neuro... <sighs> the only thing coming to mind, the only things coming to mind are neurosystemic and neurosoma. Neuroson. Uh, neuro. Uh, average. I. I can just like. 
Like, mo some days, I'm just, like, completely average person. You know, right? And then I have days where I am, like... Where, 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 oh god, I'm stuck in a loop now. I have days where I, I just come, like, fully down with, like, autism symptoms. Like, it's hard for me to talk. I do weird things with my hands. And some days I can just, like, lock up. And I think a little bit of that might be tied to trauma. That's trauma with a question mark. Um, I, I'm not. I, I can't go too much into that. But TLDR, I've been working with a therapist for the past few months, and. We're, we're trying to, it's not that we're trying to, like, understand how my brain is working, but, um, the, the, the main, the main point of, like, me going to therapy was I had experienced, like, a lot of loss throughout the last two and a half years, and it has just not been good for my brain whatsoever. Oh yeah, I think I need to get a new song from you. No? Does the Coliseum not have songs? Took them 17 years for mine, but I don't like calling myself. It. So like... I'd... So... It, it, it is a weird thing. So, one of my co-workers was autistic. But they were like incredibly high functioning. Like, you could not tell. You could not tell unless like... A specific area. Fucking shit. You cannot tell unless, like, a specific scenario came around. But other than that, like, they were, like, incredibly high functioning. Um. So, for the most part, he would not say anything about it. Like, for stuff like job interviews or, like, uh. Just uh, people who people that he uh, th uh, doesn't know, for the simple fact that he doesn't want to like be looked down upon. Because here in the wet, like it's changing slowly, but like here in America, a lot of people, especially like the older generation or uh, more southern people, more traditional people, traditionally American people will they'll either look down on you or like pity you for or feel sorry for you for being autistic when yeah like a lot a lot of people don't want that like they just want to like feel normal feel average so with him being like incredibly high functioning he just doesn't say anything unless he's known you for a while i knew this guy for like half a year, and he told me, like, uh, he, he told me that he was, like, a high-functioning autist for, like, four months when I had known him. People think I'm autistic, but I'm not. I mean, you, 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 you show the symptoms. So, like, what I'm thinking is you are, you are neurodivergent in some form or manner. Only things that are kind of wrong with me is my hatred of loud noise and just extreme hatred of touching keys, jewelries, and coins. Mmm. Is it like the the metal? Is it the shiny? Not the shiny. Is, is it like the, the cold metal? Or like the warm metal? Or is it just like... Jingly? I never tell anyone about anything but my ADHD because it's easy to be seen. You can touch other metals, it's just this thing's weird. Is it like the jingling that they make? Or is it like the the tech 
Mmm! Is it like the texture? Doctors say I don't have it. Because like keys and jewelry and uh, coins, yeah, it might be the texture. Because like, those are all like little pieces of metal with like little indents on them and outdents. Outdents is not a word, but it's the best thing I can think of. So I think it might be a, I think it might be a texture thing. God, my God, let me let me tell you something. I can never use a wooden pencil ever again. Like when I was much younger, like early early elementary school years, yeah, we were, we could only use wooden pencils. It was the only t kind of pencil that existed for us at the time. So we wrote with wooden pencils. And then, uh, mechanical pencils came around, and those were awesome. You, like, clicky-clicky, and they, they, they spew lead out. Like, clicky-clicky, put out some lead, and then write with that. And then once the lead goes down, you clicky-clicky, more, more lead comes out. Um, I then tried to use a wooden pencil again, and it sucks. It, so, whenever I write with a wooden pencil, it, like, sends shivers up my arm. Same thing with chalk. I can't use chalk because it will just send shivers up my arm and it makes my skin crawl. It makes my spine want to curl in on itself. I cannot write with wooden pencils or chalk anymore. I don't know what it is, but I think the vibrations are just awful to me. I used mechanical pencils for a year and I hated them because the lid kept breaking mid-sentence. Mmm. Yeah. I like mechanical pencils because they're smooth. <laughs> I, I, I like the smoothness mechanical pencils have. They're, they also feel nice. The plastic feels nice. But, like, I cannot write with a wooden pencil ever again. Or chalk. For me, pen is pen. I don't care. Okay, but what about pencil? For pens, you have ink. And either a pointy bit or a rolly bit. <laughs> or are they just like called the same thing over there? God, you know, I can't write with a fountain pen either. The, the dragging that the pointy bits make on like paper or wood or anything else just I hate it I hate the vibrations I hate the dragging it's all the same here you just call it pen some teachers call pencils wooden pens weird every kind strange what am I doing again Um, far grasslands, wild swamplands, metal island, snake moose den. Sold at the termite kingdom's darkest alleys. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. I could have just bought like a fucking sleep dart. I'm gonna do that. What? Ah, shit. Okay. All right, um, where's the, where's the guy? Oh, 
I want a store for the first time ever. Drowsy cake, sleep bomb. Okie dokie. Send you my PFB on Discord so you can see it better. Yeah, go ahead. Oh, you already did. Straw bunny, yeah, it's so cute. You have little ears, you have little wings. Use your bunny. Use your bun bun. Straw bunny, that's so fucking cute. I love it. I want to like, um. I want to, like, make a list of, like, every mythical or, like, uh, folktale bunny out there. Because, like, there's there's the jackalope, there's the moon rabbit, slash jade rabbit. There's, there's all sorts of bunnies out there. There's the Easter bunny. like extended bunny universe with like all these different buttons. Um, bag of flour. Yep. Dry as a cake. Alright, now... Okay, I need to make an Obama honey. That's a cat though. What's a cat? Okay, so now what I need to make. I need an Obama honey, which is a honey drop and a honey drop. And then what else do you say? A spicy bomb. How do I make a spicy bomb? My PFP. Oh, I mean, you have a... You have... You have a... Your shirt says Straw Bunny. I, so I know you're a cat. But, like, your shirt says Straw Bunny and you have, like, a little bunny pin. Are you a cat that loves bunnies? Or likes bunnies, I should say? Yee. Why wouldn't you like bunnies? <laughs> Bunnies are awesome. Here we are. Cooking recipes. How do I make a spicy bomb? Oh no. My phone's gone. Hold on a second. Turn off the alarms. There we are. A hard seed and a burly berry. What? No, surely not. Why would it need a burly berry? Shouldn't it need like a spicy berry? Yeah, it should need a spicy berry. 
Hmm. Cats over bunnies. What? The heck is that? I use dots for fuck's sake. I don't even know what you, what you were trying to like type in the first place. Um, is that cupcake? It is. So I need two honeys. I need to store four items. I think. Yeah, I need to store two more items. Okay, so where's a hard seed? Small. Stinky, small and stinky bunnies. Is that what you? Is that what you're saying? You are. No, you. You're stinky. You're stinky and tall. You don't like music. You're stinky, you don't like music, you... you don't like food, you're tall. <laughs> Bully the VTuber. I am bullying the VTuber. <laughs> Verbal Vulps the VTuber. <laughs> Are you saying you're not a VTuber? But you have a model! I, I was there for one of your streams. Lost termites, roaches, lost art of flight. I don't have a model, but I saw one of your streams. You had a model. History tells of insects soaring the sky, covering great distances. Nowadays, only the bees and only the bees, wasps, and a few lesser species seem to retain that privilege. Even so, most bugs continue to possess wings. Day-to-day -day life doesn't quite need flight, so perhaps we, as a collective, have evolved past it. Could it be that one day bees will not flap their wings any longer? Mantid claws. According to data found in ancient roach slabs, mantises used to have claws instead of hands before, day to, before the Day of Awakening. What a weird way to live. How would they be able to hold stuff to make art, or even cook nowadays? Thinking about it, this might be why they have an affinity for sharp tools. Fascinating. Some lesser mantids and mimics still have the claws instead of hands. Such a pity. Never had a model. Weird, I could have swore you did. If I could have a model, it would be one of my old Pokemon OCs. Oh, which one would that be? Exist around the world, filled with mysterious power. The old roaches learned how to harness their magic, and crystals are now used as power sources for many machinery and other things. No current side effects from crystal exposure are known, making them relatively safe. Some children's tales mention that sometimes sounds can be heard from them in a quiet enough place. Probably fake. Archaeologists say these crystals appeared in the same time the Day of Awakening started, suggesting a link between them and that event. I have a clip with 297 views. Holy crap! That's a lot! Bugs can be classified into two types, social and loners. 
Social bugs usually have a single queen, the mother of the colony. Although all individuals are siblings, they do not tend to see it that way. Some individuals grow closer to others by choice, creating their own small family cell. Social bugs are separated into workers or civilians. Workers are born to protect and take care of running the colony. Workers take their job very seriously and will fulfill their duties to the best they can. Recently, some workers have rebelled to lead the loner life. This, too, could be an evolution. The civilians form family bonds more easily and care for the general well-being of their colony. It should be noted that social bugs referring to their queen as mother is considered a taboo. The queen, however, has freedom to call others their children. Weird. But I mean, the queen is their mother, though. Unless, like, they're not that type of bug. Did you know? Oh my god. Y'all want to know a gross bug fact? Let me tell you a gross bug fact. There is a species of moth out there that looks like a dick. That's just the first half. <laughs> there is a species of ant that will search for this type of moth that looks like a dick and kill it, take its sperm, and then give it to their queen so the queen can reproduce. Y'all like that bug fact? Y'all like that gross bug fact? <laughs> yeah, I remember seeing that on, uh... Oh, what was it called? I can't remember what it was called, but it would talk about, like, weird, weird insects. I want to say it was, like, real-life monsters or something. That's what it was called. It made Werb sad. Why are you sad? Don't be sad. Be glad. <laughs> you, you facts. <laughs> Alright, let me, let me tell you a little, uh, little bit of fiction. Uh, leaf is hot. <laughs> now I'm not hungry anymore. Dang, I cured your hunger? No way. All I had to do was talk about dick moths. <laughs> <laughs> so it's funny, I took a bug quiz. Uh, like what type of bug I would be. I said I would be a firefly. So, like, if I had the money, I would love to, like, commission someone to draw, like, a Firefly bug, a Bug Fables Firefly version of me. I hate bugs. I don't like bugs either. I'm not too much a fan of bugs. There's a type of parasitic wasp that hunts parasitic wasp larvae. So like, does it hunt the wasp larvae of other wasps, or of its- of their own wasps? Other wasps. Ah. I mean, monkeys do something similar. Okay, not all monkeys. But, uh, chimps and baboons will, uh, they'll kill off the offspring of other, like, chimps. And lions, too, yeah. They'll kill off the offspring of, like, their competition. Last stand metal. And then... Oh, and then you have meerkats who just straight up kill their own young. Which is sad. 
Beetles are banned in the Ant Kingdom. But I'm a beetle. Well, okay, Kabu's a beetle. I know the ladybugs are banned, and ladybugs are a type of beetle. <laughs> Not beetles, ladybugs, fuck. <laughs> to be fair, ladybugs are a type of beetle. Why were they banned again? Hold on. There's a book in here about it. Ladybug exile, yeah. Farmer, farmer ants kept reporting the aphid eggs. That's right. Yeah. Bulgarian honey. Something about the pollen collected from Bulgarian flowers causes the honey produced here to be super sweet, but also super volatile. If the honey is mixed too thick or heated up too much, it becomes alive and turns into a being called an Obama honey. Scientists are still trying to figure out what causes the honey to turn into these beasts. Many tests point towards crystal fragments in the plants of Bulgaria being the culprit, but there's no conclusive proof. I think it's funny that magic exists in this world, but only bugs. <laughs> but only bugs can, like, uh... take hold of the magic. It's rare, yeah, but, like, there are all these crystals all over the place that are magic. Like these, uh, saving... Like the saving crystals. Then you got, like, all the crystals in the ant castle and, like, the tunnels. There's a reason why only bugs can. Does the game ever go into, like, are the humans dead? Does it ever get into that? Where the fuck do I get a hard seed from? Oh wait, yeah, I get hard seeds from seedlings, right? Oh, that's weird. Am I missing something? Oh! I can't talk to him just yet. I need to beat thingies. I've beaten ten of them already, I think. Until one of them took my eye. Now I just want my revenge, but I have no way of fighting them. Beat ten of them. I think I went too far. Here we are. I've only defeated one? How? That's ball. I know I've defeated more. Hmm. Hey, 
Okay, so I need to defeat ten of those. I then need a hard seed, which I can get from fighting a seedling. And I need to go to Snake Moon with a Den anyways. And then for my specialty, I need a golden seedling anyways. I gotta turn off the hard mode, or bug me not metal. Golden seedling! Uh. Fuck yeah! I'm so happy. I fought like two of those things already. Tangberry. Sweet. Okay. Oh, what's this way? The Seedling King. I'ma beat your ass. Now. The idea is going to be attack with you. And then freeze. Damn it. that lower our attack? Fuck off. You know what? I'm angry. Dang it. No. Yo, fuck your shit. Dash through. Oh, I forgot to spy the golden seedling. Hey V, can we keep it? What? No? <laughs> but it keeps spawning mini seedlings. It's a cuteness factory. Alright. Let's try to keep the small ones at bay while we defeat this one.
Kind of reminds me of like the big uh, Goombas from Paper Mario. Ow! Fuck. Dash through, come on. Fucking how? Hmm. Okay, so... That was awful. V! Or leaf, I mean. Can you stop spawning, please? Ah, uh, no. Succulent platter. Fucking... Fucking! I, why am I so bad with the timing now?
There we go. Crystal fruit. I should probably put on Bug Me Not now. Wait, what is this way? Chuck, that's right! Shit. Okay, so now... on top. Oh, oh, I can get that now. Not finding a way upwards. <gasps> Here. Sophie pedal. Is that it? Oh, 
Okay, so I can do you now. And I just need a hard seed and I can make a bomb. Did I get a hard seed? Tangy berry, honey drop. No. God, how the fuck do I get a... Where is this? Oh, this is, um... I'll show you. So, when you enter into... into this area, it's the place with, like, the trap door and the door. You break the grass here, jump up, and then you use V to fly over to over here. I still need a hard seed. Where the fuck am I supposed to... I love how it doesn't tell me how to, uh... There you go, Myla. Copy link. Paste. Golden Settlement? I was at the Golden Settlement already, though. Same place where you can buy the drowsy cake. Wait, really? I talked to that guy though. He only had like the sleepy bomb and the numbnail dart. better requires a spicy bomb I got the thing you need I don't have the thing you need you need to find your claw in the grasslands swamplands metal island I got the thing you need You need to go to Termite Kingdom, Drowsy Cake. Okay, so going back to the Golden Settlement then. The village near him.
Oh, what's going on? There we go. Oh wait, like in here? Oh, I'm an idiot. Hard seed, okay. Talk to you. Yep. Tangy berry. Tangy Carpaccio. Ooh! 12 HP. Give two ingredients. No, 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 no. Two ingredients. Hard seat. Shit. No. Two ingredients. Hard seed. Spicy berry. Yes. Spicy bomb. How many honeys do I have? One. I'll take it. Honey drop and honey drop? Yes. You should never mix honey improperly. Restores 12 BP at it. PP? TP. Okay. So now... Hmm. I'm, I'm gonna try to adjust myself, because my butt hurts. How is, how is this? Looks normal. Alright. Nice. Okay. I'm in the golden settlement. Was there anything else I needed here? Far grasslands, swamp lands, metal island, golden paradise. Ah. Uh, I got your thing done. Termite kingdom, termite kingdom. And I don't know if I really want to do yours. So I just need to go to the Termite Kingdom. Far Grasslands. Wild Swamp Lands. Metal Island. Okay. 
So I'll stop by Defiant Root. Because if I want to get better. Oh no, did I mess up? Ah, oh, crap. <gasps> He's hiding in the back! No, she's hiding in the back, I mean. Crispy's a little girl. And two, three, dead. A bombination. I don't get it. I did everything right, I think. A ball of honey is super dangerous. Doesn't matter how good you bake it. So sorry. I guess the forbidden wasn't just for show. It's okay, Crispy. Even if it wasn't food, you cooked it to perfection. Shame we couldn't eat it, though. Hmm. Wait up, okay? Wait, wait up, okay? I'm gonna try again. I'm not following any old legend. This dish is all me. For real now, something yummy only I can cook. Crispy donut. <laughs> the texture. I made some more for everyone. Whoa, it's super yummy. Incredible. We must have more. <laughs> Bring me a glazed honey in a flower bag. I'll have to be careful not to eat too many. Nah, -uh, give me more. We're best friends now. Come whenever you want. I'll bake you some more real tasty stuff. All right. So you, I want to take out. Did I take out too much? Nope, I took out just enough. Alright, so now I need to go to the Termite Kingdom. I'm blue, da ba dee da ba die, da ba dee da ba die, da ba dee da ba die.
Draw the cake. What if I eat one of those in oversleep? Look, it's what you wanted. You can't just ask for more stuff in the same job. You cannot miss work. Wait, I know. Hey, there's a way to make shocking candy with electric stuff and flour. Are you sure that's safe to consume? If I eat both this cake and the shocking thing, maybe I'll be able to sleep for one second and be shocked awake right after. That doesn't make any sense. We'll see. We'll see what we can do about that. Please wait a little more. A shocky thing, man. Fuck this guy. Uh, excuse us. We heard you have the blackest paint. We're interested in that. I have no business with you. Scram if you know what's better for you. Well, we need the paint. Let's leave him alone, team. We need the paint, Kabu. I know, but it doesn't seem like we can get it now. Let's ask Arlia what to do and come back later. Arlia? Who is Arlia again? Artia. Who's Artia? Oh, she's... Oh, okay, I'm dumb. You can buy shockberries in Bee Kingdom. Ah, oh, thank you. So that's shockberries mixed with flour? Yeah, shot candies mixed with flour. So I need to go to the Bee Kingdom. Far Grasslands, Wild Swamplands, Metal Island, Golden Paradise. Okay, so I'm going to Defiant Land. Hmm. Here's the selfie battle. Easy peasy. We can feel magic within it. It's sure to be what you need. How can I ever repay you? There's no need. Her Help us priceless. I hope the simple reward is enough. HP core. I mean, it's cool, but is it enough? Don't be like that, V. Uh, no, she's right. Your help is really priceless. She's always like that. Don't worry. Just a little extra. Hey, Darn. <laughs> Unbelievable. Thank you, Isao. We hope your research goes well. For the sake of all bugs out there. I'll try planting a Sophie here too, that should save explorers a lot of trouble. It's gonna grow great, you're super kind! <laughs> well, let's toast to that. Nice. Dope. Okay, so now... 
crap. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Shit. Found it yet, V. Yeah, he won't budge though. Sorry. I feared this would happen. Listen up. My boyfriend lives in the Ant Kingdom. Knows his way around certain groups. He'll know what to do. Boyfriend's a pretty vague description. We have similar tastes. You'll know when you see him. Now go, your pay is waiting. Charging extra for the double trip. And then this way. Here I go again on my own. Going down the only road I've ever known. Like a drifter, I was born to walk alone. Well, well I made up my mind. I ain't wasting no more time. So here I go again, on my own. Okay, so... We got the shock berry, now I need some flour. Can I even buy flour? Mm, no. I want to store. Okay. Flour. Cook with two. Yes. Shot candy, nice. I'll take that back now. Did I give him the drowsy cake already? Yes. So now... Um, Ant Kingdom. That's not it. Same taste. Don't tell me. Oh. Smiling dish. Aria! Okay, so now... Someone with a similar taste. Wait. Oh, is it you? But... 
Dang it. I'm hoping to God it's not him. Please be the librarian. No, no. I don't want to fight the things. <sighs> hmm. Alright, I'm gonna talk to the fly. The ultimate dish, combining the most sweet thing with the most tangy feeling. And your two dishes not found anywhere else, which together will contain these qualities. Once you've found them, bring them back to me. The reward will be well worth it. Well gee, that's helpful. Ultimate sweet with the ultimate tangy. I'll have to figure that one out later. Ant Kingdom's shadier part. Oh, wait. Is it you? Are you Artia's boyfriend? Yes, I am. What is it to you? Looking for trouble, chubby? We're doing a request for her. She asked us to get the blackest paint, but the guy that has it doesn't want anything to do with us. I know she wants the paint, but I really didn't want her to get involved with that guy. Maybe a tough guy, but she is my soft spot. Wouldn't want to get her into trouble. Since you're going in her, since you're going in her place, I suppose I could assist you. I used to know the guy, but we have uh, we've had a falling out, so I couldn't get the paint from him anyway. Probably do something horrible to me if I went by myself, but he still owes me a favor from long ago. So here, give this to him. Shady note. Don't you dare open that. It contains sensitive info, info for his eyes only. Just give that to him and don't ask questions. He'll give you the paint. You know, just saying that makes us even more curious. Leaf, don't, alright? Wouldn't want to be wouldn't want to never be able to sleep again knowing something could happen to us. Listen, just do this and everything will end without issues. I can trust you with that, can't I, V? Yeah, yeah, I know, Reed. Just leave it to me. Good. This is so shady. Okay, so now I need to go back to the Termite Kingdom, which is perfect, because I have the candy now. I ain't wasting no more time. Now here I go again, on my own.
The shocking thing? Yes, here. So, will it give us a reward or not? TB plus medal. Heavens, we hope they don't promote you into more work. I'm so worried. Oakley dokely locally. Oakley dokely locally grown vegetables. Shady note. We got a response! Fine, here's the paint. But I do this fever for Reed, not for you. Blackest paint. We no longer have any business between us. Leave. Gee, what a moody fellow. Well, we got the paint. Let's deliver it. And so, back to the Bee Kingdom. Hermagerd. Found it yet, V? Yep. So that's the blackest, darkest paint. I can feel it. It's like I'm staring at a deep abyss. Hope it's worth the pay. Jewelry is for denizens of the light. We have no need for it after having set, seen such darkness. Seems like a fair trade. The brightest object for the darkest one. Soon, Jean's art rain, Jean's art rain will be over and our tears will begin. Yeah, I doubt that. I'm just glad we didn't end up in trouble for this. Nice. Okay, so now... Lost books, awful beauty... Too hot, find the ingredients. Peacock spider. So now, I go talk to the girl on Metal Island, I think. Okay, so Far Grasslands, Wild Swamplands, Metal Island, Golden Paradise, Oh, I should talk to Artia first, probably. You came. I'm very grateful. It was our pleasure, Acolyte. You look well. What seems to be the issue? I'll be brief. Do not waste your time. I'll be brief. Do not waste your time. 
planning on giving the goddess an incredible offering. An offering? Like a lot of berries? Goddesses don't need money, but it's a bunch of food. That is correct. Oh. <laughs> it is? Seriously? I wish to give her a banquet worthy of one as great as she is. I've prepared several dishes that I have, but I'm missing something grand. What sort of dish are you looking for? It's hard to say. Something I cannot simply buy would be excellent. You could ask Fry, Cut, or Crispy to make something with their specialty, perhaps? I've heard the Chef Fry has been planning his masterpiece. The goddess would be overjoyed to taste something that divine. So, uh, you think she'll give us something for it? Of course. Venus is generous, kind, and loving. If you make her happy, she will reward you. Fry's masterpiece. We'll do our best to get it for you. No, I gotta do like I gotta find like the most sweet thing, and the tangy thing. So I'm gonna guess the most sweet thing would be honey, and the tangy thing would be a tangy berry. You have my thanks, Team Snake Myth. I'll be waiting here for you. Um. Fry, cut, and crispy. Fry's masterpiece. And his masterpiece. The ultimate sweet with the ultimate tangy. Oh my god! Ultimate sweet and the ultimate tangy! Fuck, and I was just at the Ant Kingdom too. God damn it. Venus, damn it. So... I have what you need. Queen's dinner. Ooh! This is something only I can cook. Just bring these ingredients back here and we'll make as many as you can eat. Thank you very much for this. Na na na. Thank you. Welcome to Fetch Quest Simulator. How can I help you?
heals any status effect. Damn! Aria. <sighs> so? Yes, I can tell this dish is something worthy of giving to Venus. Nice! So we just have to deliver to her, right? Indeed. You must venture to the top of the hills and deliver it to her. You go on ahead. I shall catch up in a bit. Alright. See you at the top. You're freaking cute! I love you! You're so cute! Wait a second. Huh? What? You three look like you're looking for something up here, are you not? That's very perceptive of you. Indeed we are. Do you think I could help you? I doubt it, but we thank you for your offer. Come on, try me. I know these hills inside and out. Uh, let me check our quests. There's someone who's restricted to himself to a small cave. Kind of a weirdo, right? Could you take me to him? For what purpose? I don't know. I think I can help. Trust me? This whole request chain is a bit abnormal. Very well. Please stay close to us and we'll escort you to Sir Hermit. No rush. Don't forget to enjoy the sights you came here for. Gosh, she's so big! She's so cute! That's a pretty bug. Goddess Venus! Goddess Venus! Hiya! V, Kabu, it's a long time no see. I'm especially glad to not get spooked by you, Leaf. Uh, sorry. I can't help it. Goddess. I have brought you a humble offering with the help of these brave explorers. Please enjoy to your heart's content so that our village may be blessed for just a bit longer. Aria, you know the festival's more than enough. But thank you. I can tell it's going to be wonderful. Let's share, shall we? Oh. My. Self. Can earthy ingredients reach this flavor? We're gonna have to hunt down more tangy berries. It was beyond my expectations. Thank you so much for sharing with me, goddess. It was nothing. I've never had a picnic. I'm feeling overjoyed. Team Snakemuth, you're getting a healing discount from yours truly. Only five berries now. Should have been the regular- Ow! It was our honor. It was worth it as soon as we tasted that dish. Please, take this medal too, as a token of my gratitude. A prayer medal? So relieved you enjoyed the offering. I'm sure I'm glad I don't constantly moder monitor everyone. Who <laughs> ruined the surprise? Come back again, yes? Your most pleasant company. Anytime. Sweet. So now... Hmm. Where did I find that guy?
Metal Island. Look. I need to go to the Ant Kingdom. And then I gotta head this way, down, Here goes. Uh, Hermitude, is this what you were looking for? Bug? My request led you to another bug? In hindsight, probably not what a hermit wants. Hello! I've heard of your quest, that you have been here for so long. And? You'll try to make me see the bright side like all the others? Oh, not at all. I think this place is lovely. If it's kept you entertained, it must be full of hidden wonders. Would you mind if I stayed and looked around? If that's okay. You look at this world in a wholly different way, don't you? You're not searching for the meaning in things. I think things happen just because. I love to admire the results. I would like you to stay. Call me Techie. It'll be my pleasure. Explorers. Yeah. Yes? Thank you. I never expected you to go this far for me. Uh, me neither. Do we just play matchmakers? As long as everyone's happy. This is the one worldly thing I have left. It is from my younger days. I'm glad I kept it. If only to give it to you. I must thank you too, although I have nothing to give. Don't worry about it. We'll leave you to your introspection and stuff. If you ever need us, just post in the town's quest board. Elon's been here for so long but there's a flower he never noticed. Techie's got such a good eye for the small things in this world. It's really refreshing. I'm blessed you made us meet. Elon's been here so long, blah blah. Oh uh, yeah, I'm not gonna make it. Sad. So now... Peacock spider. Somewhere in the metal lake. Which, funny enough, this guy is in. They like to swim in the metal lake. And I need to go to the metal island, anyways. Alright! So, Metal Island it is. Actually, I should rest.
Okie dokie. Now... Shit. <laughs> Metal Island. Hello again. <laughs> Why did I teach you how to play? There you are. Oh, what kind of bug are you? You're cute. Hey, uh, are you the lost sister's, uh, sister? I... I... Have some tech. Have some tech, V. Pardon her. We're explorers who took your request. Ah. I get it now. Thank you. So, what happened exactly? My sis is super strong and brave. She has always taken care of me. I saw her taking a walk with this wasp. I trust her, so I didn't get worried, but she hasn't come back. She must have been kidnapped. How did a wasp make it here? This place hasn't been a target at all. That is not. We have someone to rescue. I've heard them mention the wasp kingdom. They've got to be near it. It's my turn to be brave for sis. I'll meet you in the far grasslands entrance. Wait, you're going too? We'll be right there. Please be careful. Far Grasslands. So, this way. Actually, I want to check and see how many bugs are left in here. Just one, right? Yeah. One tunnel left. This is not where I need to be, is it? Shit. Is 
This is giving me anxiety. So it goes Seb's loss again. Pretty much. We were sightseeing the swamp. And when I turned around, he was gone. Sightseeing? He's incorrigible. Madeline, why would you think this is a place to take in sights? I've heard of the leaf bugs living here. I wanted to meet them personally. But, yes, the area is also full of monsters and murky water. They didn't mention that. Listed tourist agencies. Well, that's fine. We'll get him back. This time, I shall accompany you. But, but, do not worry, I can handle myself, and I may even get to see some leaf bugs. And I can't just stay here worrying about Seb, it's mortifying. Let's go, I went to the swamp. This isn't just a laser trip, you know. Easy there. We'll get through this just fine. Okie doke then. Good of escort you, you know. It's okay, I gotta be brave to rescue Sis. I will still accompany you from here to the Wasp Kingdom, at least. It'll be fine, just stay behind us. And then there was another far grasslands thing, right? Yeah, I need to look for the guy's hand. I don't even know if I'm heading the right way. Oh shit. That's a battle arena. <laughs> Um, that's where the peacock spider, ain't it? No? Huh. What is this place for, then? Oh, I think I already fought this thing. Oh, there's the mechanical claw. Nice. Now I just need to go to the Wasp Kingdom.
so I want to go to the right then. Actually, I could probably do the Swampland right now. Where the heck you at, boy? This isn't where he is. Yeah, no. I must have missed him somewhere. Shit. Fuck. Damn it. You probably can't freeze that, can you? No. Hmm. 
Can I just go up here? Sub dude, are you in here? Wait for us. Shit, I'm an idiot. Seb! Well, I am deeply sorry for abandoning you once again. I'm relieved you're safe, but must you keep causing me so much trouble? <laughs> Lady, please. How can I make up for this mistake? Hmm. When we return home, you shall make me your legendary delicious treats. I will not let you down. Thank you once again, Team Snakemuth. I'm in your debt once more. No problem! You can repay it, you can repay it now if you wanna. It's a bit dangerous here. Would you visit me at my residence? I live just next to the Explorers Association. Gotcha. We'll leave this dreadful place then. I'll make sure Seb does not get lost again. Don't mind us. We'll follow you every step. See you later, Team Snake Mirth. No. Shit. Alright, now to be on my way out of here. So, going this way... Damn it! This way. No shit. Now I gotta go through this bullshit. No, no.
Okay. So now... What's this one here? Oh, can I dig under? No. Wow. You look cool. Wow. Sis, get away from her, you, um, you kidnapper. What? Kidnap? What are you talking about? Don't play dumb. You stole her sister. But Rebella's my... Bumble, what the heck? You're ruining my date. Date? With a wasp trooper? Oh dear. You have a date? You didn't say anything. I thought you were trying to do something spontaneous for fun, okay? It's true. I invited her here. And she said yes. Please, understand. <laughs> Please, understand. Tensions have been running high. Who cares about all those politics? We just want to be together. Why didn't you tell me? I thought you wouldn't approve, so... Of course I do! You support me in everything! Wow, your sister is cool, Rebel. We're sorry for this misunderstanding. No, it was my bad. I should have told you, Bumble. Guess everything's fine, then. S still, we could probably stay at Metal Island until the conflict dies down. Yeah, right, I guess. Spent some good time here, anyways. Thanks for caring about Rebel so much. Here's a little something. Hey, You're a cool dude. Sorry for the scare. <laughs> I get that a lot. We'll get going now, then. Take care. Nice! So now, the only quests I have left are the books. Metal Lake. Gather ingredients, gotta return to you, gotta return to you. Alright, so I just have the Metal Lake stuff, essentially. Do I get to Metal Lake, now that I think about it? That's good food. Shit. Damn it. Okay. Too hot. The wizard. Fruit that blooms where there's no life. So I'm guessing that's a fruit blooming in the desert. Would that be a cactus? It could also be the uh, the the badlands or something. The nectar from critters of the land. Honey. Nectar from Critters of the Land.
Okay, so I need to go to the Ant Kingdom and Defiant Room. So let's go to Defiant Root first. But, ooh, excuse me. Sorry about that. Here's your claw. Fits you very well in gun. Can you make something cool with it? Well, it'll take a bit, but I do have this prototype. Reflection metal? Nice. <coughs> so then I gotta go to Ant Kingdom to turn in the Seedling King and Butler Missing. Here we go. Thank you. And away I go. I'm gonna guess it's this house. Yes, indeedy. So happy to see you visiting. I haven't shown you proper gratitude for saving Ebb. Twice. <laughs> I can only hope this is enough. Please visit anytime you wish. Help yourself to some tea. Thank you. We were wondering if you could lend us one of your umbrellas. The heat's starting to give you- YO! It is! Must let us pay you for it! No sir, no! It's the least I can do after you've helped me so much. Thank you. It'll really help us out. Yo, fucking sweet dog! Love the underbell served you well. Underbell? What the fuck? The lady is an incredible person. Wait a minute. Nice. Hmm. So now I just turn in it's too hot. Actually, I should go check out the lake. Shh. 
shit. <laughs> Why am I all the way over here? I'll be right back. I gotta use the bathroom. Um. <laughs> that looks so stupid. <laughs> I'll be right back. I should move myself off to the side so I'm not, like, staring at everyone. Hiya, my love. Hi, babies. Are you a pretty girl? Are you a pretty girl? Yeah, you a pretty girl, aren't you? You a very pretty girl. Hi. Alright, I am back. Let's get that off screen. My boat! The wolf sunk it! Damn, really? Huh. Well, shit. I guess I'll just go to the Termite Kingdom then. 
Because they're the only ones with a boat now, I think. Hey, wait a second. Fuck. There we go. Huh. I feel like I should be able to just like float over there. Probably not though, am I right? this? Resist all. Nice. So now, just return the books, and I should be good. To Defiant Root, and then to the Termite Kingdom. Keep thinking the library is on the right. Ant compass. Berries as currency. It's unknown how long bugs have been using these specific types of berries as currency, but it's a very effective method. Hard, long-lasting, and very bitter. These berries are almost never eaten for their horrible taste. The small size is perfect for carrying them around, too. There have been recorded cases of some bugs actually enjoying eating these berries, but almost no one can stomach their taste. There are some rare berries in Bulgaria that are worth a lot. A lot. We call them dark cherries. The red counterpart has been found in the eastern lands, but due to how common they are, they aren't as sought after. Dark variants strangely seem to only grow underground. Meanwhile, the red ones grow on tall trees. In any case, some bugs have a keen sense of smell for dark cherries. They're hired to find them, so they may be sold to collectors. Nice.
Phew, did you find something for the heat? Wow, that umbrella is beautiful. It's one of a kind, but perfect for your needs. <laughs> Don't I look cute? Super cute! Now to seal the deal. You must have gone through such a hassle. I hope this makes up for it. I want to take this too. Whoa, are you sure about giving us this much? Yeah, it's a lot. This umbrella will last more than 20 ointments. It's okay. We are grateful, Miss Remy. We hope you have cooler days ahead. Thank you all so much. I'm going to get going now. She really does look cute with that, though. And now the termite kingdom. Down I go into the hole. Oh, what's going on over here? Bulgaria should be the perfect place to expand my business. You're the winners of the Colosseum, right? So you'll take us to Bulgaria, yes? Let's get going. Time is money. Nah, I don't think so. I'm so excited! Bulgaria, I wonder what it's like. Y'all are cute. My time has come. Let's get going. Alright. Behold, our subaquatic maritime neo-transporter. It's... Nothing like we've seen, for better or worse. You can truly travel under the tides. Do it a while, you'll have the time of your life. Bugs have never been able to travel this way. Phew, okay. I'm not gonna trust it. We can finally get to the everlasting sapling. And beat up the king, too! This long journey is nearing its end. But we must not rest until we're victorious. It's a bit too early to rally. Let's head to the outskirts pier. We must pick up our reinforcements. It's very intuitive tech. You can move as you usually would. Just dive with circle, then there just dive with circle when there's danger, just in case. Let's give it a whirl then. Time's running out. Jesus, okay. I'm gonna wanna dash through.
And that makes two striders, I think. God, I need to defeat ten of these things. I fight those again? I need to freeze them, right? No. No? Why would anyone want to live underwater? She's bouncing everything off. I have to wait. Well, in that case... Thing that makes three striders now. Yeah, I've defeated four of them now.
aircraft. Whoa! You're a wasp. Let's come back after we drop off Eliza. Oof. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't pass out for long, did I? I didn't mean to. Um. Yeah, I don't think I can do anything, so I think I just gotta do nothing. Fuck. 
God damn it. So I think... I think after I like clear this area of enemies and then drop Elizant off at the Eight Kingdom. Sorry, I, I think I'm like, I think I'm like dreaming while I'm moving around. I'm very tired. Come on. Fuck. Damn it. Bitch. Fuck off, motherfucker. Five, good.
Your Majesty, you have returned. Indeed. It was an experience like no other. I'm glad we all made it. I'm glad we all made it. Same. But surprisingly sturdy. So this is Bulgaria. It's greener than I'd heard of. The sunlight is so warm. Too warm, though. And the breeze is so heavenly. It's my pleasure to welcome you to our land. What's our next step, then? I will escort our allies to the city as part of our deal. Wedge, was it? Yes, Queen? I trust the royals have briefed you on the task. Yeah, I'll try to fix the sunken ship. Guess I'll sightsee later. Team Snakemuth, ready to go! You are to take the subaquatic maritime tra neo transport and head towards Rubber Prison immediately. By ourselves? When the ship is fixed, we'll send reinforcements. We're at risk of being sunk again. We have no time anyway. Please, wreak as much havoc as you can. Clear a path for us. Very well. My one's eager to deliver those... to deliver justice to those rascals. Yes. Deliver as much justice as possible. I have a small gift for you. Yo! I believe this will help you gather supplies. It's more than enough. Thank you. It's more than enough. Thank you. We're at the crux of this long chapter of history. Spare no time in your preparations. Leave it to us. Together, we'll triumph. I'm all fired up, too. I'll start work right away. We're all counting on you. Good luck, my friends. Alright, so... I'm going to save... And with that... I'm gonna end the stream. I uh, hope you all have a good day. Thank you for watching. I hope you all had fun. I definitely had fun playing this game. Oh, I'm definitely getting tired near the end though. I <laughs> started to like have micro dreams while I'm while my eyes are open. Um, Yeah, if you, if you liked it, feel free to like, subscribe, follow, click the bell, do all that, do all that junk. Uh, you can check my socials down below in the description. You can follow me, subscribe to me on YouTube and on Twitter. Uh, my handles are the same, at capital J, Jade, underscore, capital B, Bun Bun. Uh, you can follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash all lowercase jade underscore underscore bun bun. And uh, you can check the, the playlist for the rest of the bug fables in the description. Uh, thank you all for watching. I hope you all have a good time. Bye bye.